Behind me is the Companion Motors T-Rex 16S. It's a hybrid Formula One motorcycle for the street. It's an incredibly special machine, so we brought it here to the streets of Willow to put it to the ultimate test. So this team, uh, screw it, we'll do it after the acceleration because it's freaking scary! This is probably the most thrilling experience I've ever had behind the wheel of any car. Also one of the scariest, the T-Rex is technically registered as a motorcycle, so you don't get the normal things like no power steering, no power brakes. It's all muscle. But, it's incredibly responsive. You have to be on top of your game at all times. It's, uh, see this corner so I don't kill myself. Don't want to miss this turn. I missed this turn earlier and we'll die. It really gives you that formula car feel. Turn, turn, turn. I don't want to hurt myself. Go fast, look good for the camera. Rock on. All right. The acceleration though is out of this world. You hear guys talk about cars like the Evo or something saying it's incredibly intuitive. Cars like the Evo are supposed to be telepathic and do what you want before you even think it yourself. That's bullshit part of my French. This car is the most responsive car I've ever been in. It seems to react before, I think. The nice thing about this car is there's no windows, there's no doors. It's all open so you can see where exactly the wheels are touching. If you want to hit the apex, you want to put the wheel on the apex, you can see that wheel touch the apex. I'm not a pro driver, so I can't put the car on a quarter like Sylvester Stallone in that one uh, IndyCar movie, but you know, I'm having fun, I don't care. Oh my God! So I just spent the entire day here at Willow with the T-Rex and I'm still at a huge loss for words. It's both the most terrifying and the most thrilling car I've ever been in. What I can say for sure, I need to run this track again. Oh, I'm gonna cry. Oh, I'm gonna cry. Okay, break. I need to change my pants. Oh my god, I don't know if I can do this. This is fun. I'm afraid I'm gonna kill myself, but I love it.